Welcome, fellow explorers, to Anime Lore Unveiled, your guide to the mystical realm of anime mythology. In this fascinating world, the extraordinary and the ordinary intertwine, where mythical creatures from ancient folklore breathe life into modern narratives. From the cunning Kitsuna to the mighty dragon, these creatures have left their indelible mark on the genre, enchanting audiences worldwide with their captivating tales. Today, we'll embark on a journey through time, tracing the evolution of these mythical beings from their roots in traditional folklore to their present-day forms in anime. We'll explore their cultural significance, their impact on anime narratives, and their potential future in the genre. So, buckle up, adventurous, as we dive into the enchanting world of anime mythology. Let's begin our journey with the mythical beginnings of these extraordinary creatures. In the heart of the enchanted forest, a nine-tailed fox roams, its golden eyes gleaming with ancient wisdom. This is the Kitsuna, a mythical creature from Japanese folklore, brought to life in the world of anime. In the vast universe of anime, there exists a realm inhabited by creatures of legend and lore, each with their unique tales woven into the fabric of countless narratives. The Kitsuna stands as one of the earliest and most enchanting of these mythical beings. From the earliest written records in Japan, the Kitsuna has been revered, feared, and adored. With its roots in Shintoism, Japan's indigenous faith, the Kitsuna was seen as a messenger and servant of the Shinto deity Inari. This divine fox was believed to possess intelligence and magical abilities, including the power to shapeshift into human form. As the art of storytelling evolved, so did the Kitsuna's role. Its transition into the animated world was a natural progression, a testament to the enduring allure of these mythical creatures. In the realm of anime, the Kitsuna took on a new life, its folklore origins reshaped to fit into modern narratives. Its cunning, wisdom and magic were translated into captivating storylines, enriching the genre with a touch of the mystical and the enigmatic. Take, for example, the Kitsune character in the popular anime series Naruto. Known as Kurama, this nine-tailed fox spirit is not just a character, but a cornerstone of the narrative, influencing the protagonist's journey in profound ways. The Kitsuna's transition into anime is not just a testament to the genre's capacity to reimagine folklore, it is also indicative of the genre's ability to shape and be shaped by cultural narratives. The Kitsuna, with its intricate ties to Japanese culture and mythology, served as a bridge, linking the past to the present, the traditional to the contemporary. The impact of the Kitsune on anime was profound, paving the way for the integration of other mythical creatures into the genre. It set a precedent, demonstrating the potential of folklore to enrich, diversify, and deepen anime narratives. Thus, the Kitsune paved the way for a myriad of mythical creatures to enter the enchanting world of anime. As the anime realm expanded, it gave birth to a new era, one ruled by the majestic and fearsome dragons. Dragons, these mythical beasts of lore, have been a cornerstone in the narrative tapestry of anime. They first emerged in the ink of manga artists, then transitioned onto the small screen, becoming a staple in the anime universe. Their depictions vary greatly, reflecting the rich diversity of the genre itself. From the celestial dragons of One Piece to the iconic Shenron of Dragon Ball, these creatures are as diverse as the series they inhabit. In Japanese mythology, Dragons, or Ryu, often symbolize strength, wisdom, and benevolence. They are revered creatures, associated with the elements of water and sky, embodying both the serene and the terrifying. This cultural significance is mirrored in anime, where dragons often play pivotal roles. They act as guides, protectors, or formidable foes, shaping the narrative arcs of many beloved series. Take, for instance, Spirited Away, where the mighty river spirit Haku takes the form of a dragon, symbolizing both the tranquil and tumultuous aspects of nature. Or Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid, where dragons coexist with humans in a modern setting, highlighting the juxtaposition of the mythical and the mundane. The impact of dragons on anime storytelling is profound. They bring a sense of awe and grandeur, infusing the plot with an element of the extraordinary. They challenge our heroes, forcing them to confront their fears and overcome monumental obstacles. But they also offer wisdom and guidance, leading our characters towards self-discovery and growth. Dragons also contribute to the visual spectacle of anime, 
Their design, whether intricate or simplistic, adds a layer of aesthetic richness, enhancing the overall viewing experience. Whether it's the detailed scales of Fairy Tales' Acnologia or the ethereal glow of Blue Dragon's shoe, dragons are a testament to the creative prowess of anime artists. In the clutches of these mythical beasts, anime found a new depth of narrative richness and visual spectacle. From the shadows, a new breed of creatures emerged, the yokai, embodying the fears, hopes and mysteries of the human psyche. As the sun set on the Age of Dragons, the moon rose on a world teeming with yokai. These creatures, born from the whispers of Japanese folklore, found a new home in the world of anime, each with their unique forms and roles. The yokai are not a monolithic group, they are as diverse as the human emotions and experiences they embody. Some yokai, like the mischievous Kitsuna, with its cunning and shape-shifting abilities, often serve as tricksters, challenging the protagonists and pushing them towards growth. Others, like the terrifying Kappa, lurk in the depths of rivers, embodying the human fear of the unknown. These creatures represent the obstacles that the characters must overcome, often serving as a metaphor for their internal struggles. But not all yokai are harbingers of chaos. Take, for instance, the benevolent Teng, often portrayed as protectors of the mountains and forests. Their presence in anime narratives often symbolizes the healing power of nature and the potential for humans to find peace amidst turmoil. The influence of yokai on anime extends beyond their roles as mere plot devices. They lend depth to the characters, shaping their personalities and driving their actions. When a character faces a yokai, they are not just battling a creature, they are confronting their own fears, insecurities and aspirations. Moreover, yokai influence the dynamics of the plot itself. Their unpredictable nature keeps the audience on the edge of their seats, adding a layer of suspense and mystery to the story. Their presence pushes the narrative forward, propelling the characters into a whirlwind of adventure, danger and self-discovery. The introduction of yokai in anime marked a significant shift in the storytelling tradition. It allowed for a deeper exploration of the human psyche, where the characters' interactions with these creatures mirrored their internal journey. With the yokai, anime delved deeper into the human psyche, weaving tales of fear, courage and redemption. In the modern realm of anime, mythical creatures have evolved, reflecting contemporary themes and narratives. Today these mythical beings have taken on new forms and meanings, beautifully melding the old with the new, the traditional with the contemporary. Anime, in its ever-evolving nature, has reinvented these mythical creatures, straying from their traditional depictions, yet retaining their core essence, and in the process addressing contemporary issues and themes. Take the Kitsune, for example. Traditionally a trickster in Japanese folklore, the modern Kitsune in anime is often portrayed with a nuanced character, embodying both mischief and wisdom, reflecting issues of duality and identity prevalent in today's society. Dragons, too, have undergone a transformation. Once feared and revered symbols of power, they are now often depicted as allies, embodying themes of friendship and loyalty. They have become metaphors for strength in unity and the power of companionship, ideals that resonate powerfully in our interconnected world. Yokai, the supernatural beings from Japanese folklore, have also been reinvented. Anime has breathed new life into these classic creatures, presenting them as complex characters rather than mere supernatural beings. They are often shown grappling with human emotions and moral dilemmas, addressing themes of empathy, acceptance and coexistence. In the anime series Natsume's Book of Friends, for instance, yokai are not just supernatural creatures, but characters with depth and complexity. They struggle with their identities, yearn for acceptance and even form bonds with humans mirroring our own societal struggles with diversity and acceptance. In the same vein, the anime Noragami presents its gods and spirits in a contemporary context, dealing with issues of existential crisis and the search for purpose, themes that resonate with the modern audience. These modern interpretations of mythical creatures are not just entertaining, but also thought-provoking, encouraging viewers to reflect on societal issues and personal values. They continue to shape the narrative landscape of anime, making it a canvas of endless possibilities. In their modern avatars, mythical creatures continue to shape the narrative landscape of anime, making it a canvas of endless possibilities. Beyond the realm of anime, 
these mythical creatures have left indelible marks on global pop culture. The influence of anime's mythical creatures is indeed far-reaching, permeating international cinema, literature and art, and leaving a profound impact on the cultural landscape. Let's take international cinema, for instance. The fantastical creatures and narratives of anime have inspired a myriad of films outside of Japan. Hollywood blockbusters, independent films, even animated features from around the world have borrowed elements from anime's mythical bestiary, showcasing kitsune, dragons, and yokai in their storytelling. The allure of these creatures and the mystical world they inhabit have captivated audiences worldwide, demonstrating the universal appeal of these mythical beings. In literature, the influence is just as profound. From fantasy novels to graphic novels and comic books, the lore and legends of anime's mythical creatures have found their way into the pages of countless books. The rich tapestry of these creatures, their intricate histories and diverse characteristics have become a wellspring of inspiration for writers, sparking imagination and breathing life into new tales. Art, too, has been touched by the mystical charm of anime's mythical creatures. From pop art to street art, from sculpture to digital art, the presence of these creatures is undeniable. Their unique designs, symbolic meanings, and the narratives they embody have made them popular subjects for artists, encouraging new interpretations and expressions in the creative process. Moreover, these creatures have also found their way into fashion, music, and even food culture, further solidifying their status as cultural icons. From kitsune-inspired clothing lines to dragon-themed music albums, from yokai-shaped pastries to trendy anime-themed cafes, these mythical creatures have transcended their origins in anime, becoming symbols of creativity and imagination in various aspects of life. Thus, from the heart of anime, these mythical creatures have ventured into the world, becoming icons of global pop culture. They have not only enriched our cultural experiences, but also deepened our appreciation for the limitless possibilities of storytelling. As we journey forward, the realm of anime stands on the cusp of a new era of mythical creatures. The ink of imagination is still wet, and the canvas of creativity is far from filled. Mythical creatures from the majestic dragons to the elusive yokai have been pivotal in shaping narratives, and their future seems no less promising. In the coming years, we can anticipate a more diverse array of mythical beings breathing life into our screens. As the world becomes more interconnected, it's expected that anime will draw from a broader pool of global mythologies, weaving a rich tapestry of diverse creatures into its narratives. We might also witness a deepening complexity in the portrayal of these mythical creatures. Rather than being mere plot devices or symbols, they could evolve into fully-fledged characters with intricate backstories, complex motivations and emotional depth. This evolution would not only enrich the narratives but also provide a fresh perspective on these mythical beings. Moreover, the future may shine a spotlight on lesser-known creatures from Japanese folklore. The limelight that once favoured dragons and kitsuna might shift to underrepresented beings, offering viewers a taste of the less explored corners of mythology. Another exciting prospect lies in the intersection of technology and mythology. With advancements in animation techniques and virtual reality, the depiction of mythical creatures could become more immersive and visually stunning, blurring the lines between fantasy and reality. Furthermore, as anime continues to tackle pressing social issues, mythical creatures could serve as powerful metaphors, facilitating nuanced discussions around themes like identity, diversity, and environmental preservation. Ultimately, the future of mythical creatures in anime is a blank page, awaiting the strokes of visionary creators. As these creators draw from the well of mythology, infuse it with their unique perspectives, and paint it with the brush of technology, we can look forward to an array of enchanting tales. In the hands of visionary creators, the future of mythical creatures in anime holds an enchanting promise of tales yet untold. Our journey through the mythical creatures in anime has been a tale of enchantment, fear, courage, and transformation. We've traversed the mystical landscapes painted by animators, where the lines between reality and fantasy blur, creating a realm that is as mysterious as it is captivating. We began our exploration at the mythical beginnings, the genesis of it all. We saw how the seeds of mythology bloomed into grand narratives, infusing color and depth into the world of anime. From the majestic dragons, with their fiery breath and impenetrable scales, 
to the cunning kitsune, shape-shifting fox spirits known for their wisdom and mischief. Each creature has a tale to tell, a lesson to impart. Then, we entered the Age of Dragons, a time when these mythical creatures reigned supreme. They were not merely monsters to be defeated, but symbols of power, wisdom, and the untamed forces of nature. They breathed fire into the hearts of heroes and shaped the destinies of kingdoms. Our journey took a turn into the eerie shadows of the yokai invasion. These supernatural beings, born from the fears and beliefs of people, encapsulated the darker side of the human psyche. They reminded us that not all monsters lurk in the shadows, some reside within us. As we ventured into the era of modern mythical creatures, we saw how these ancient beings have evolved, reflecting our changing world. The mythical creatures of today's anime are more complex, embodying not just good or evil, but a spectrum of human emotions and experiences. We then delved into the cultural impact these creatures have had, shaping not just anime, but the fabric of Japanese culture itself. They've become symbols, metaphors, and inspirations. Their stories echoing through time, influencing literature, art, and even our understanding of the world. Peering into the future of mythical creatures in anime, we glimpsed a world of endless possibilities. With the advancement of technology and the boundless creativity of storytellers, these mythical creatures will continue to evolve, reflecting our hopes, fears and dreams. As we bid farewell, remember, the realm of anime, with its mythical creatures, is a world of endless possibilities, waiting for you to explore. The stories of these creatures are not just tales of fantasy, but reflections of our own humanity. They remind us of our capacity for courage, kindness and resilience in the face of adversity. So, as you delve deeper into the world of anime, remember to look beyond the fantastic and seek out the extraordinary lessons woven into each narrative. Until next time, stay curious and keep exploring. Did our voyage through the mythical creatures in anime ignite your curiosity? If it did, then don't keep that spark waiting. Dive deeper into the magical world of anime with us. Subscribe to Anime Lore Unveiled and join our ever-growing community of anime enthusiasts. Here, we unravel the intricacies of anime lore explore its cultural impact, and celebrate the boundless creativity of this medium. Each video is a new adventure, a fresh story waiting to unfold. So, hit that subscribe button and the notification bell to ensure you never miss a chapter of this enchanting journey. Stay tuned, stay curious, and remember, in the realm of anime, the extraordinary awaits.